This team does play hard. Yeah, they absolutely play hard for their head coach. So Tim Frazier starting Drew Holiday out of the lineup once again. Buddy in the backcourt. And Lexi Jens got the league in scoring at 102 a game. Frazier, and he beat the big bear. Uh, he's had a couple of games where not like what we're, we've been used to. And... So Willoughby points off a takeaway. Rodriguez wide open. And an early AD clear out for him. And goes by Ilyasova. Blocked away a beat there to clean the percent. Their leader is Ilyasova. Hill underneath and a nice lead. And now they switch. Ilyasova will get him and get picked off. And Anthony's got his first bucket. Liking to be in the gym and, and you know, taking his, his game serious. It's a nice pass. Yep. He came over. The little guy challenged him. Yeah, just enough. Ilyasova. He's warming up, isn't he? Hersan Ilyasova was 4.05 left in the opening 12. Dario Saric, who was in the 2014 draft. A little flip won't work. Asha could clear it away. Saric, though, he came over on a draft day deal for Alfred Payton. Buddy! That was more decisive. Buddy got in there, and Asha will give him another try. It's got away for three, and a lead for the Pels. Yeah, Holmes done a good job for them off the bench. 6-10 out of Bowling Green in his second season. AD right back the other way. Stauskas yet to look for his own. Sarge is not timid about that. And that brick knocked around. It was over the back. There's no question. And they're going to get a uh, bucket out there. A little bit of a fallaway action for Langston Galloway. So Langston with five off the bench. Ashik with... Eight off the bench, and a nice take, getting all the way there. That was down and popped back up. So Covington, the 26-year-old from Chicago, who played at Tennessee State. Brown against the shot blocker, and Galloway corrals it with a left hand while he's under the cup. That's and tough. Henderson got a good challenge. MB back tap, smart play. Kid gets it. That's his first season, don't forget. So Joe, he's the jab, the triple threat position. Not bad. There's Embiid. Frazier didn't think he read it. Embiid, almost like he looked away and then gets it the other way. He's already got two blocks. And that ends a three-minute dry spell for the Pels. Up by six. Wide open, the wrong guy. Fortunately for them, they're getting the stops. 40% for the Sixers. As I said, though, Pell's defense has improved this year. Buddy on the run out by Covington. Terrence Jones got him out of position, and he made him, made him pay. Anthony Davis finally up against Ilya Sova. And right by him. Down. Hollis Thompson in. Got Rashawn Holmes in there, but the Pell's didn't know for some reason. All get our assignments. No pressing in the backcourt. Three and a half to play. Terrence Jones again. They don't exactly take away the, the strong side from Terrence, do they? One name. Do you remember Dick when he got up? Oh, yeah. No. Oh, what about Jan Vesley when he got up? Draft night. Right. <laughs> Anthony going hard to the hole. Uh, Anthony Davis. Hard break at Terrence Jones, rather, at the free throw line. Makes two. And going after MP, Solomon Hill. Help out. I like the drop down. Now MB. He's got the easy one. How about, the, how about a hand good. over a guy that's over seven feet? Living dangerously. Spin out. Yep. Anthony Davis got the rim. He'll be back at it. Smart play with Langston Galloway on the inbounds. Communication. The 76ers, I said they warmed up. They've hit five of their last six, though. The deep into the clock is Stauskas. Back to back. Nick Stauskas, former Michigan Wolverine. But right now, it's Embiid going to work. Or you can give them confidence. Make them feel like they're, they're right here in this game. And it's now tied. And it's tied. And Embiid's only getting better by the rep. So the first five points of the second half, belonging to the Sixers. Pels couldn't take advantage of that Aaron one. Is there anybody close to Embiid in rookie of the year? 18, and the next leading score is around 9 or 10 points a game.
And I'm not talking about just points, but I'm talking about all the categories. A lead, you got it, and the shot clock. Seven and nothing to start it. It's almost four minutes in. Tells back up by four. Well, because he's struggling from three, hadn't hit one in a, in a while. It seemed like he was trying to be a lot more selective. Look at that. Count it run. on the take. Now the matchup. One on one. You set it. Clear out. MB. Anthony. Step back over MB. Good he's defense. Yeah, beautiful. Better offense. Now what a stroke. But Jensen can't handle it. Another turnover. Flores space, Covington, Rodriguez on the trail, and it could have been an one. Don't forget of the break. Good bounce entry. Holmes denied. They wanted three, and they'll get it from Covington. I'm talking about three seconds, the people behind <laughs> me. But they got three from Which Covington. three? Yeah, which three are we talking about? Good carry. And Frazier will convert. That's a has new hesitation. Instead, they're asking him to shoot it. And now we know why. As John Holmes clears it away, it'll be Covington on the break and a lead for the 76ers, 69-67. So Pels have to recognize there's only 1.7 on the shot clock. Got to go up. AD knows it. Finally. A little bit. And the Pels overall. Nine, we're not singling out two guys because it's been a group effort. Pels missed 15 to their last 17. And it's going to be... A chance is foul with Stauskas in his game. I follow their hair. Yeah, he had six for eight a couple of games ago. Mm -hmm. And most from beyond the arc, he's shooting at a decent percentage. It'll be a Jensen. It'll be Embiid. And Stauskas saves it. So the Pelicans with ten turnovers. Ten turnovers as well for Philadelphia. But the Pelicans been outscored 15-4 to four in points off the stakes. Next pass, McConnell. And a good bounce by a real lead. Stauskas for a three. Look out. Saw that out of his hand. Looked pretty good. Uh, three, almost three in. And you might want to time out 79-71. That's the largest lead of the game for the 76ers. Eight points. Bad part is it comes with AD on the floor. He's got some space. He's got Saric. Looking for it. Tie him up. And beat his strength, pulled it away. As they're four minutes gone in the fourth. AD's got 25. Stauskas up against Buddy. He's going to get the look he wanted. There's a challenge, but it was already out of his hand at the rim. Back to eight, and the Sixers getting confident. Galloway going to the line, looking at the three point play. And that's bitten him a lot. In the recent games, too. Mm -hmm. Galloway's got space, and he's got the triple. Well, the confidence for Langston now. He's got 17. Galloway up against the longer Covington. 10 on the shot clock. Solomon Hill off the pick. Trying to get there. Throws it away. 11 turnover. Bad timing. Trail to Sarich. And count it. Yeah, he just split it. Will they celebrate at the Pell's expense? They're 4-18 overall. So forget about it. And it's Sarich on a late close. Only 4.9. Ilya Sova knows it. And that's a backbreaker. Biggest lead of the night. This is a little bit of a shock. I'm sure it's going to be a shock to them. It's going to be a long plane ride tomorrow. Wide open. End of the shot clock. Buddy will get it. Final 20 seconds. Uh, so Brett Brown, I hope they stay with him. Because when they were tanking, he took the hits. Uh, Jensen, that'll be the final score. An 11 point win for the 76ers. Pelicans scored 31 points in the second half. That will not get it done. Not enough. Not even close. So, 12 points in the third quarter. It was it's just the beginning of their.